This stuff is magic. It's like whipped cream for your face. I would say that a few years ago, I started to not feel like myself. I saw my skin getting drier and saggier. I started to have real anxiety, mood swings. I started to have insomnia and food allergies. What I thought was happening to me at first was the result of the physical trauma of spine surgery and the emotional trauma of losing my father. And it wasn't until I started doing my homework that I realized I was actually in perimenopause. So perimenopause is when you start to have hormonal changes in the body that affect both your physical and mental health. Uh, perimenopause typically occurs around 51, but it can start as early as 39, and the effects of menopause can go on for up to 20 years. I started to see my weight change. I got the menopause middle. So once I realized this was menopause, I really started to do a ton of research, and I started looking for products that would help me through this transition. A friend came to me and said they were starting a brand called State of Menopause. And I thought, hallelujah, somebody wants to do something about the effects of this life transition. So I got on board as a beta tester and uh, I became the CEO. I acquired the company and now I run it. So State of Menopause is a personal care and lifestyle brand. And it started basically with topicals and skincare. And now I have a menopause routine and I found some really great products that I know work for me and can't wait to share with you. So when I wake up in the morning, any kinks, anything that's been bothering me, I have this great band from p -Volve which does strength training and flexibility and stability training. They have great classes, but this I use both to strength train like this. But what I really love in the morning, I just wake up and I stretch with it. Oh. Okay guys, this is my morning routine. Now I've already washed my face in the shower. My first product after I have a clean face is the cooling spray. It works not just to cool down my face, but as a great toner. Now, what is a toner really meant to do? It's meant to moisten the skin so that it allows the pores to open to make other things seep into them. I love the light cooling facial gel. It's super goopy, right? It's glycerin based, not cream. And so it's very, very lightweight. Now, honestly, this could be for any weeknight or any weekend where I'm feeling a little bit tired, my skin feels tired or sallow. I put on this two-piece hydrogel face mask from State of Menopause, and I just chill. 10, 20 minutes, my skin feels totally refreshed and hydrated. And certainly, if I had like a martini or a little too much wine the night before, this makes all the difference. I've never cared more about hand cream in my whole life. It smells delicious. I have dry skin now. This also comes with age. It also comes with how dry your skin gets in menopause. But most importantly, my joints get sore. And that can be an effect of menopause. So this gives me nice, smooth, soft hands, which, you know, everybody appreciates. But it also helps soothe my sore joints. <laughs> this is the Cocoa Body Pillow. Now, it is nice and comfy and soft and lovely. Great for your skin, great for your hair. Velvet on one side. But if you get super hot, turn it over to the quilted side. The entire technology stays completely cool all night long. It's the best. It also comes in pillows. So what is the criteria? One of the, for, right, one of the criteria yeah. for, for menopausal clothing. Well, you want clothing that breathes. You need clothing that you can layer because you go from hot flashes to cold flashes. And we, we want to make sure that, you know, we've got something for both. I talked a little bit about the menopause middle. It's just that there is body weight redistribution. Right? There's something called, the reason that we get bigger tummies as we age is something that called visceral fat, which is not like, you know, subcutaneous fat where you're like, oh, can I pinch an inch? I'm like, yeah, I can pinch an inch. Yes, that's not it. It's the kind of fat that it surrounds your organs. And where are all your big organs? Right here. In your middle. In your middle. So that's why doctors will tell you, you know, you want to be careful about the weight that you gain in the middle section. So look, I needed a gene if I was going to deal with a tummy that has 45% stretch. Just, just grab this and pull. She's a slingshot. It doesn't bag out, it doesn't change its shape, and it goes up nice and high, not a girdle, don't get me wrong, but it's a nice high-waisted jean. 